Chase. Happy Thursday. Welcome back to Chats with Chase, and here's your next tip. If you're working with an assembly that has a number of components, it can be a hassle trying to move views with their balloons. An easy way to deal with this is by using magnetic lines. I'll quickly auto-balloon this drawing so we have something to work with. When these come in, they look nice and neat, but if I want to reorder or organize them differently, I'd need to drag each one individually. For example, let's say I don't want these on four sides anymore, just on the left and the right. It's pretty tedious and not something I want to spend my time on. Instead of doing that, I'll grab a magnetic line. Placing my first point, I can move it around and essentially pick up any balloon I want to attach to it. I'll just put the second point below it where it snaps to vertical. If you want a little more control over the line or the balloon spacing, you can use the property manager. You have the ability to control the length of the line as well as angle. You can also define equal spacing or free drag along the line so you can space the balloons however you like. I want essentially the same thing on the other side as well. Now it looks kind of messy since lines are crossing over each other and some balloons might belong better on the other side. That's an easy fix though, just grab the individual balloons that are out of place and drag them to either another position on the line or another line altogether. Now with these lines made, I can move all balloons easily. Thanks for watching. Contact me if you have any questions and I'll see you tomorrow.